I bought a fake Chinese one, but uh, I don't want it to cheap it out. Actually, the fake Chinese one on AliExpress or on eBay, it's around um, 20 or maybe 30 dollars and uh, I paid for this one, for a new one, 70 uh, from German seller and uh, I will explain you uh, the whole thing. Um, this is the this is the original one. I think um, this is the original one because it has also the number uh, on the bike. This was the first, it's actually 11 years old, my bike and uh, my connector it's totally totally fried and also the regulator rectifier. I just uh, screwed in the new regulator rectifier. I changed also the connectors, like the old connectors, and uh, I went for a ride. It's around 70 km, and I come back and I checked all again the dashboard. And the dashboard said uh, 12, 12, 5, 12, 3, or 12, 8 maximum voltage and uh, this is really low because these bikes uh, Ducati 848 um, it has to be around 14 between 14 and 45 okay so yeah wh what's the problem actually uh, I measured out uh, I don't want to show you in the video how I measured out because uh, 20 uh, videos uh, around the internet. You can check them up. Uh, even one video says uh, idiot's guide uh, for a regulator rectifier measuring. So yeah, it's really easy to do. You have to get a multimeter and so on. Okay, so I found out that uh, the new one is uh, bad. Uh, I just found out that this is a fake one, but uh, like I said, I, I don't want to cheap it out. And uh, this seller uh, was a, a German seller. Uh, right now you can see uh, this uh, page uh, in the video. I will cut a picture um, for for this seller and you can see the name and I hope you guys you will never ever buy something from them because uh, uh, I just started to complain about it. Uh, maybe I was a little bit harsh and I also did a video, a comparison, and uh, I did also video what I found on the internet and um, it, the seller was, was really, really rough and unfriendly and uh, uh, he just sticked with a lie. Um, he just was, doesn't want to admit that I am right okay you will get uh, your money back please don't give us uh, a negative rating or something else no complete bullshit okay so um uh, just a quick comparison actually the outside measure is is always the same uh it has longer cables which is actually pretty handy it's pretty good and really really uh, important thing as you can see right now on the picture this seller said uh, that it has a better electronic inside and it has longer cables and it comes with a new connector kit okay new connector kit really fine after that that was the lie i just found out this is a fake one uh, the original one uh, has a smaller cable also on the back side the original one has a, a smaller electronic this has maybe yeah that's bigger but I don't know if it's count or not <laughs> or if it means something and right now I will cut uh, half uh, uh, the video I can show you one side what I found on Aliexpress actually I found that um, if you type in Ducati regulator, just Ducati regulator, you will find uh, the first five or six item uh, will be this one. I showed the seller that uh, the corners uh, are the same like on AliExpress. The, these points, the number of points, these are the same. And the back side how big is the electronic inside, also the same. The cable length, also the same. This black wrapping is also the same. Even, even uh, uh, how they lined up uh, the cables, also the colors, everything is about the same, but uh, he just wanted to stick with the lie and, and I am wrong, I am wrong. Um, I cannot return um, uh, just after uh, eBay comes in. I hope you guys you can find some original one under 90 
euro or under hundred dollar, you just shouldn't buy one. actually three weeks later because the last one I just ship it back I got my money back after I, I give also the, the negative rating uh, for the seller so after that um, I just decided I don't want to um, play this game again and I want to buy a MOSFET regulator the original one. Uh, I had a bit of a little bit problem with the, with the timing and I live in Italy and from the roadcycle.com uh, the real Shenzhen MOSFET regulator is actually maybe two weeks or three weeks so it's actually a little bit late for me uh, that's why I decided to uh, go again eBay but, and the German seller also, not the same from another one. Actually, you can see uh, the name right now in the video. They have also a web shop, MTP Racing, with, with, with shipping it was actually 130 euro, which is, yeah, like a, like a normal uh, MOSFET regulator. With the Triumph cables for my Ducati and I got it and I saw again this is not the original ones. The um, S regulator is actually a bad regulator but um, I'm very curious so if you have any experience with this one then uh, you can please tell me please tell me because because I, I I really really curious about it so like I said it was hundred and uh, yeah this is the old one the original Ducati one uh, hundred and thirty euro and this type of regulator this type of MOSFET we can say MOSFET maybe uh, the electronic inside maybe MOSFET I don't know um, uh, it's everywhere on eBay actually 100 euro around 100 euro with shipping it may be the same 130 or, or something else without the cable or with the cable it's it doesn't matter i didn't install install it um, uh, i measured it out and uh, right now you can find a link in the description below where uh, from the original roadstarcycle.com uh, there one measuring video the problem uh, what uh, what I checked for the first and you can check it also you can uh, write in in the Google Alibaba uh, MOSFET uh, FH 20 AA and uh, if you go to the pictures in the 10 first picture you can say this one like around 40 or 50 dollars not for 100 only for 40 or 50 euro uh, the text uh, are the same on Alibaba uh, like on the MTP racing webshop um, and on Aliexpress you can you cannot find this one um, you can buy it a group buy or something you can buy for 100 uh, 100 pieces together and not not just just only one so i didn't find this one on aliexpress but um yeah on alibaba i found it i found it and only for 40 or 50 usd this was for me the end actually uh, but about the outside every mosfet regulator has a metal plate on it which is which is good actually this is this one also has a metal plate on it but to, to screw this is not on the on the original one these are not um, also two holes you can compare it with the roadstarcycle.com you can find original picture what it look like uh, also this point um, for example the original hasn't got any like any like this also the text it's not the same uh, the, the outside measuring I don't know but but I think it's the same or around the same these are the same like the original one color 
the original album is actually not that uh, glossy black color. It's like this one, like this gray color or something. I found another website uh, on Amazon and uh, somebody uh, wrote two reviews about this regulator. With that says, this is a bad one, after one year it's fried out. Uh, it's not reliable, this is not, a, not a, an original MOSFET one. So, after I saw this I decided also, no, then it's, it's a no-go for me. One thing what um, I wanted to say, I don't know who made these cables, but uh, actually, like I said, this is a Ducati 848. Uh, if I have to compare it, I hope you can see them, this is the original one and you can see the free cable uh, end it's at the center normal at the center and by the new one it's actually a little bit on the side especially this one and um, I don't know uh, how will it be with, with, uh, with the connections and so on so I'm afraid also a little bit And then finally, um, two or three weeks later, uh, we have here, thank God, the original one uh, from roadstarcycle.com. It was actually uh, over 150 euros with the Triumph cable set also, the original one. I didn't even have to show you um, uh, the differences or 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 show you a measurement with a multimeter because we, we have also video on YouTube from Roadster, Roadster Cycle and uh, the numbers are the same actually. Um, everything is the same. Uh, if you click on the side you can see also the holes are the same, the back side with those points and so on. The Triumph cable set comes actually in, in this bag. We can say homemade um, or something and just look at the just look at the cables how tiny is the original cable and how thick is the is the mosfet one is the triumph cable and also also by the alternator side actually i hope you can see it um, yeah it's really really funny to see it and uh, it has also um, i don't know i think that is uh, that is um, just some electrical paste for the better connection. I am not sure that uh, this cable made from Roadster Cycle, I don't know, but I think uh, with those uh, thickness it will be absolutely okay. If you want to have one of these uh, to Europe from California, so from, from roadstercycle.com, with, with, with shipping and all together it's, uh, it's over 150 euro, but not 200 euro. It's really expensive, but if you want your bike uh, uh, running cool, this is, the, this is the good choice. This is the good one. Uh, I will also move this one to the side, next to the horizontal cylinder, uh, but you can also retrofit it. Um, like I said, this this one is for a Ducati. This, but it's an universal regulator. You you can use it for your Suzuki or or something. But um, yeah, oh yeah. Also the number is over there. I just forgot to mention it. And uh, what really surprising for me, it's that. The weight is actually the same like a fake one and um, and and actually the same like a good original one actually. Uh, 327 gram and this one, the MOSFET, is 322 with the cable set all together. Um, I think it's, uh, yeah. It's 437.39, yeah. So it's really surprising, surprising me because I told that the original one it has uh, maybe some some better some heavy items uh, inside, but yeah, actually that's not the case, and I am not a profession, so that's it. I hope. You can find it interesting if you have any question or if I can help you in a way to install one of these uh, for a Ducati. You can write me, I, I try my best 
um, have a safe ride. About the install, I will post also also videos soon. Thank you.